Good afternoon. Welcome to the Terrace Talk. Here we are in Narrabeen Lakes. We've driven all the way in. We're at Sydney and we've been discussing this afternoon the subject Christopher brought up about how do we fast track ourselves to get free and to overcome this world, to overcome the flesh, to overcome the self, to overcome the ego. It's taken us so long. He was talking to Mark and I and we've been so long dragging the chain, trying to get free, trying to find the way and trying to keep our behavior on track. And we have lapses all the time where we go into you know, listening to demons and giving ourselves excuses to reason reasons. And we wanted to come, wanted to bring us to get to a point where we could actually find the answer. We could find a key. We could find this answer finally so that we can fast track ourselves to get free of this world and our ego and have our behavior come good in Yahusha's sight, to be blameless in Yahusha's sight and to have his favour and hear his voice continually. Well, we spoke about our thoughts, we talked about demons, we spoke about how we get dissuaded and dissuaded and sometimes I said that I like to actually listen to demons because I enjoy running myself down and feeling, you know, that I'm, I've wanting sympathy for things and feeling sorry for myself and all this hopelessness. And this hopelessness gets us nowhere. We came to the understanding, brothers and sisters, and this is so important, to know that we are chosen. We are chosen. We are sons and daughters of the living Elohim. Yahushua came to earth he came in the flesh and he died and rose from the dead. He took that power and his power he's invested in us. And here am I sometimes saying, I, I'm nobody, I'm nothing, I can't get it together. The answer is in this key. In everything that comes to us, we must summarise. Summarise the situation, bring it together make up our mind about what we're facing, listening to Yahusha and what he wants us to say in this situation, what he wants us to say in this situation. We went and visited our um, Chris's sister-in-law. His brother has died a few months ago and she's distraught and we went to visit her this afternoon and she's in such a state. And I just watched, Chris was there and he listened and understood. And she was talking about all different situations and the political situation, the world and what a dreadful state it's in and how she just was totally upset and distraught and we had tears and she was still mourning her husband's death. And he listened and understood and then finally gave her the truth about the understanding of Israel of Yisrael and what Yisrael's plan is for the world to build a new temple and to bring the sacrifices back and to have his esteem there in a fake way and she was overwhelmed blown out and just through this experience she said thank you so much for visiting us because I'm so happy there's someone that understands me and doesn't think I'm mad and she was so grateful now I looked and I didn't realize what Chris was doing. But in that visit, in that time where we were around the kitchen table, he was taking into consideration and summarizing the whole situation, facing the truth, summarizing it, and listening to what Yahushua is saying. Listening, and he gave, had the delivery of the truth and gave her a word of, that would help her in her life to see the truth of what's going on in the world. This is something that I haven't done. I've, my mind hasn't been on, but I can see if we summarize every situation, bring it, bring it to the, to the word, 
face the truth about every situation. If it's not Yahusha, don't go in there. If it is Yahusha speaking to you and wants, wants you to talk, go there. And if we summarize and face the truth, make up our mind, and we will know, we will know Truly, we will be living in the supernatural. Our behavior is so important in this. To have the behavior to come to know Yahushua and to be in his right behavior. This is the key how we can fast track ourselves out of the darkness, out of ourselves, out of thinking of ourselves, out of taking everything personal, out of taking things into our own ego and wanting to give our advice, wanting to give our knowledge and put lift ourselves up. This is the answer, brothers and sisters. We need to come together and have one mind and believe that this is an amazing understanding that Yahushua has given us this afternoon to be able to fast track and get free and know that you are chosen. He's put you in a situation where you are to start, to overcome, to bring things, summarize things, to bring things into an account. Mark was, gave us the word summarize and he summarized what we were talking about and how he brought it together and gave, got this key that we need. In our thoughts, we have to summarize what is right, what is true check it with the word all the time is that you Yahushua is that your word is that right or check it and summarize and the account of how we're doing it all and what we do with what Yahushua gives us he says when he gives you something do it straight away and here we are in the evening coming to sunset and it's just the most beautiful afternoon the birds are chirping and Yahushua, in his supernatural power, will come into you and give you all the most wonderful understandings that you've always wanted to know. And you'll hear his voice because his thoughts are more numerous than the sands, than the sand on the seashores, the grains of sand on the seashores. His thoughts to us. We must believe we're chosen. Don't doubt that. You aren't nothing, brothers and sisters. You've been called for a reason. Don't doubt your, your place in Yahushua's economy. He wants us to be active, to be in this, this time where people are going to their death. He wants us to be light in the world. He wants us to have that truth that will emanate and that some most of the time it's a gentle quiet spirit it's it's quietness and understanding and caring and being kind and listening and not butting in and wanting to give you knowledge it's the most wonderful place to be in i'm going to go there and put all this to practice because i haven't been and i've been all over the place in a quandary and things won't work when i'm all over the place everything goes wrong and I'm so sick of that situation. Living in his supernatural power is something very different from living in the world how we've been as believers. This will fast track you brothers and sisters. Take it on board, let's do it, get there and face the truth about what you see. Signing off now. Bye for now. Thank you.